In this example, we want to integrate the following function. So for our function, we have the square root of tangent 3x times secant squared 3x. So we're going to do this by uh, using substitution method for integration. Okay. So what we want to do here is we're going to let u be tangent 3x. Okay. Because when we take the derivative of tangent x, we get a form of secant squared x here. Okay. So for u, Okay, we have tangent of 3x. So the derivative of this with respect to x is going to be secant squared 3x and then times the derivative of 3x, which will give us 3. Okay, so from here, okay, this is going to be du equals to 3 times secant squared 3x times dx. Okay, so du, okay, du is equal to 3 times secant squared 3x. Okay, so uh, for the 3, we can go ahead and divide, we can go ahead and divide both sides by 3. So we're going to have 1 third du equals to secant squared 3x, dx. Okay, so that gives us the, uh, this form here. Okay, so secant squared 3x dx is going to get replaced by 1 third du. Okay, so we have the integral of square root of u times 1 third du. Okay, so now everything's in terms of du. So we can go ahead and take the integral of this. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and take out a 1 third. So we have 1 third times the integral of square root of u du. Okay, and this is the same as one third times the integral of u to the one half du. So we can go ahead and use the power rule for integration. So this is gonna give us one third times u. Okay, we add one to one half, that's gonna give us three halves, and then divide by three halves, okay. Uh, one third uh, divided by three halves is going to give us two ninths. So we have two ninths times u to the three halves. Okay, so from here we just need to replace u with tangent of three x. So we're going to convert back in term. We're going to convert this back into x. Okay, so we have two ninths times tangent of 3x to the power of 3 halves, okay, plus some constant. Okay, so this is the result of our integral, okay. So this is the antiderivative of the function that we're given, okay. So, all right, so in this case, we, we let u be whatever is under, we let u be the tangent 3x that was underneath the square root. We took the derivative of that, and then that allowed us to convert the rest of this function in terms of, of u. And then we apply the power rule, and then uh, apply the power rule for integration, and then converted it back into, into, into x. Okay.